Sup bro, if you're a beginner at meditation, you probably have some questions about it. And some of these questions prevent people from actually doing meditation, which is completely crazy. So in this video, I'll answer some of these, some of these questions like, what if you can not clear your mind from thoughts? What if you need to scratch your nose? What if you don't see any results? You know, all of these questions, I'll try to answer four of them in this video, the most popular one once so the first one is i have a piece of paper right here what if i can't clear my mind from thoughts the purpose of meditation is not to clear your mind from thoughts it may seem like that from ex from the explanation of some people because many people many many people even on youtube even people with a lot of subscribers don't explain meditation correctly Meditation is not about clearing your mind from thoughts. Meditation is about learning to put your focus back on what you're doing, not on your thoughts. So like, if you have negative thought, you don't need to remove it from your mind. You don't need to do anything about it, actually. You just need to get your focus back onto what you're focusing on. So if you're focusing on breathing, which is, by the way, I find pretty difficult. So usually I focus on some sound. I have a pretty loud AC unit, you can hear it right now, most likely. And I focus on that because that sound has a lot of details into it. It's not just some noise. If you actually listen to it pretty closely, you will hear that it has some details. I don't know how to explain that better, but it has some details. And so I focus on sound. You can focus on anything, on temperature, on feeling of your clothes, on breathing, if you find it easy for you on anything it doesn't matter what it is and so when you're meditating you need to focus on that one thing when you're focusing on that you will get distracted by your thoughts this is a natural process this is not it doesn't mean that you fail at meditation like this is there, there is no such a thing as, as failing at meditation is it is completely normal just put your attention back at the thing you're focusing on so like if you're focusing on breathing and you're, you're getting this thought about, I don't know, your ex, how is she right now? I need to text her. Just start focusing back on breathing. Forget about it. Obviously, th this th thought will be there for maybe a minute, maybe two minutes, maybe 30 seconds. But eventually it will go away because when you, fo when you don't focus on it, when you don't give it your attention, it, it, it goes away. This is what meditation teaches you. Question number two, what if you need to scratch your nose? Or, you know, in general, what if you are uncomfortable with sitting? Just sitting still and doing nothing. This is also completely fine because honestly, you don't sit a lot without doing nothing in your life, right? So obviously it will be uncomfortable at first. Obviously you will want to scr scratch your nose or whatever. But the thing is, it comes with practice. The more you sit still, the better you will be at it. And honestly, there is nothing wrong with scratching something if it itches. What I do is, if I need to like scratch my nose or something like this, I first acknowledge that, like I think, okay, I have an itch, I need to scratch it, and then I do this. But obviously, don't let yourself do it without thinking about it. Because in meditation, meditation is about awareness. You need to be aware of what is happening with your body or in general, around you, in your life at this moment. And at this moment, you need to scratch your nose. If it is true, then, and you acknowledge that, and you know that you need to do this, consciously, you recognize that there is a need for it, then go ahead and scratch it. There is nothing wrong with it. People just like to overcomplicate stuff that is not require an overcomplication. So I hope that answers your question. If you're really uncomfortable with sitting still, don't try to sit still for 10 minutes straight. Meditate for three minutes or for two minutes for whatever amount you can. And then with practice, you will be able to sit for longer and longer and longer. Question number three, what if I don't see any results? If you don't see any results, it means 
you don't meditate enough. Not like in one day, but in general, you don't meditate for a longer, long period, long enough period. In order to see some results from meditation, you need to meditate for, I would say, at least two weeks. If you don't see results after two weeks, after a month, after two months of meditation, you probably just don't notice these results because the change is not immediate. Like when you start meditating, you, you're not immediately getting more, you, you don't get happier at this very moment. You don't get more focused at this very moment. Your prefrontal cortex doesn't grow at this very moment. It grows over time. When you do meditation for a month, two months, then you will see, possibly, you will see some results. But if you don't see results, again, it's because the change was slow and you just don't notice that. If you will stop meditating, you will get back to your previous level. All your progress will go away and you probably will not notice that either. But the thing is, if you are meditating consistently and you are meditating correctly by focusing on something, then you will definitely get results. You may not notice the, them because, again, they don't come at once. But believe me, you will get results. Question number four. Do I have to meditate every single day? If you want to get results, yes, you have to meditate every single day. Because can, the most important thing in meditation is not how much you meditate in, a, in one day. It's how consistent you are. If you meditated one second today, two seconds tomorrow, three seconds the day after, four seconds another day, you will still be better than a person who meditated 10 minutes but only one day. Like seriously, this is how it works with meditation. The most important thing is to meditate every single day. It's better to meditate for one minute every day than 10 minutes once a week. Yes, the person who meditates 10 minutes once a week will meditate more in general, more time. He'll spend more time meditating, but you will be more consistent and you will get more progress because consistency is the most important thing in meditation. And you need to remember that if you want to get results. I meditate every single day for whatever time I have. I mean, obviously, I don't spend hours meditating, but at least I meditate for one minute and maximum is 10 minutes. I just don't see a point in meditating more. And I have a... How do you call this? Habit tracker right there on my wall. And I meditated pretty much every day this month. So, meditate every day if you want to see some results. And that's it for this video. I have a Discord community right now. Finally, I created a Discord server. This is the first link in the description. Click it right now if you want to join.